stay on the floor. No, 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 no. Stay on the floor. That keeps that keeps what's it called when you don't change clothes between the shots. After you get the muffin full of continuity. <laughs> Welcome to Shelf Street. Yeah, because I need to do it with that. Then you have the, the pie with like that. Okay, now this is this is your own serving style. Let's, let's see what chef. I'll show you what that was. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Chef's quite. <laughs> Chef's Corner. <laughs> Do we? Welcome to Chef's Corner. <laughs> oh, hey, Vsauce. <laughs> okay. okay. Do you want Pick me to it. say anything or no? Pick a name. Hey, Vsauce. Xander here. Welcome to the third annual episode of Chef's Corner. I'm terrified of the face I was holding. <laughs> hey, Vsauce. Xander here. Josh here. Welcome to the third annual episode of Chef's Corner. Today, I don't know where I'm looking. <laughs> just like extremely serious, not breaking character. Ready? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the third annual. <laughs> Wait, no, I've got it. Hey, Vsauce. Michael here. Welcome to the third annual episode. <laughs> hey, Vsauce. Josh here. Welcome to the third annual, annual episode of Chef's Corner. <laughs> Alright, so what are we doing today, Spencer? What are we doing today? Today, we're making pies. Pies? Italian <laughs> pies. Italian pies. Italian pies. Italian pies. Making ourselves um, some Italian pies. It's the holidays, so we figured we would go back to your roots. Yes. <laughs> your roots. And just, just do a good <laughs> It's a classic Italian dish. Yes. So today we're making some Italian pies. We've got the non bread. <laughs> We've got the non bread. The left beef. Wait, that's right. We're thinking stage left. We've got the non bread. We've got the left beef. And that's it. No, I'm just kidding. Old cheddar. Aged for a millennia. We go spicy. We have <laughs> spicy tomato. Oh, no, no, no. Can't. No branding. No branding. No branding. No branding. Spicy no branding, branding. tomato <laughs> and parmesan. Yeah, for Italian pie. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so we're gonna open up with our non bread, I believe. Do you want to get ourselves? What do we need? Ground beef. Oh, uh, we gotta get the the crust of the pie. There we go. <laughs> got them out. We're good. <laughs> Preparation from start to finish. Yep. Two, two nice plates. I think yep. we I think we do one each. Where were we? <laughs> Italian pies. Italian pies. Non bread's all set up on the plates now, so we're gonna. Uh, uh, do you have your good side? Oh. Gotta get the nice flat side. A completely real stopping point. That's like a good tip for making. Italian pies. Next, we're gonna set ourselves up with some tomato sauce. <laughs> All right, so we got the tomato sauce. <laughs> so we got the tomatoes, but you're doing it like that. Okay, no, no, this is this is your own serving style. Let's let's see what Chef does, because then I'll show you what I was thinking. <laughs> okay, yeah, decent. But why are you doing mine? <laughs> see what I was gonna do. Yeah, I was gonna go for just a little bit more of a sauce hand with this, right? Just you do have saucy hands. Give it a little friend. bit of a spread like that. Yeah. That's not a face, don't worry about it. And then I like your, oh, your I, I, the spoon. I liked how you were doing that. The way I thought about doing it, okay. really, was just getting my finger nice and messy, you know. Getting it right, right in the center, and just... Ooh, 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 so like a good even... Jesus Christ. Now, 
<laughs> Hear me out. <laughs> Next piece for it, big time, is gonna be, uh, we're looking for cheese, I think. Cheese, Yeah, we gotta, yeah. we gotta prep ourselves up some cheese. And as any good chef will tell you. Yeah. As our third annual episode, yeah, and, and as you guys know, we, we built a history of trust with you guys over these last three years. Um, we're trying to make this the best quality foods, helping you all eating healthy. Really, we're doing more than Jamie Oliver does. Um, and uh, it's because of that that we've garnered the viewer base that we have. How the fuck do you open this? Um, yeah, uh, so just, just, you know, get yourself set up with some cheese. It's such an important piece of pie. We all know it, but it's so easy to ignore it. You know, it, it feels like this automatic part, um, but you, you need to put thought into this. You need to put love into it. And yeah, now I'm definitely bleeding, but um, you, you just get it ready to go. And then once you have it all set up, you've grated all of your cheese. Yep. And then you can get ready for your next step. What's the next step, Spencer? Dress the pie. So when you're dressing your pie, you have the ability to just go a little bit light on things. You know, you don't have to go too aggressive or you can um, just go incredibly light with it or you can go incredibly heavy with it. You have tons of options and it just make it your own. Go for some larger chunks, go for more heavy, more mixed. I would say generally you wanna get your larger chunks down at the bottom, just let them surface. Um, and the rest of the stuff just coat on top and that'll give you some nice mountains to feel inside of your mouth. Uh, and these pies are just about ready to go into the oven, so I'm gonna drop you off at the Meat King. After this commercial break. Excuse me, do you have the chance to talk to our... Hey guys, today's video is sponsored by Nick Skoriath. Right, Nick? No. Welcome back from the commercial break. I want to make the meat. Uh, super important with this, cook it as fast as possible. All right, if you let this simmer at all, anything like that, you go max heat, speed, burn it if you need to. That's how it tastes good. And then as the, the king of meat, how are we going to be prepping this one? As the meat king. Meat so king, speak, pardon me. Um, we're going to grab the meat. Firmly. Firmly. Firmly grab the meat. Thank you, sir. Yep. Too firm. Too firm. Too firm. Okay. A strong grip on it. <laughs> uh, we're gonna cut this open. Just like here. I and think. just like a brief, you know, circumcision, right? Just taking the top off. <laughs> one quick <laughs> little off the top. <laughs> yeah, just, you know. That's enough, right? Yeah, that's one good. Fuck, we're. It's okay. It's here? Yeah. Oh, God, you're putting on the timer. Wood. Probably. No, don't, not wood. Not wood? Wood, wood. Yes. Why does wood bad? Wood bad? It absorbs the meat juices and then it Too much meat juices, you don't want to keep that in your wood. Now, for seasoning these, what the fuck are you doing seasoning? I just take a look at the cupboard. Oh, okay. <laughs> and really, you know that you're at the stage of cooking to be comfortable when you can just look at a shelf and know what needs to go in. You just feel the flavors all come together. So I'm thinking two picks. Chicken, chicken. It's fucking chicken. That's for soup. Oh, it's closed. Don't open it. Oh, shit, my bad. <laughs> Almond extract? I feel like you can't feel it. So we're going to stick with these, I think. And it's important to consider all the options you have available to yourself. You know, that's, that's super big. And this. Oh boy, that one's going to be good. <laughs> Dude, that one though? That one's for oh. taste. That one's flavored with all the breads. It's like actually the flavor taste. Yeah, that's a wrong flavor. <laughs> Toothpick, good thinking. Taste test. Oh! We thought that was it. <laughs> Fix the camera, dickhead. No, with the fucking pan. Why are you putting it just all on the pan? That's not for me. Gets rid Oh, you're gonna mix it? Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah. What did you put in here? Peppercorns. <laughs> yeah, toss a couple. We're good. All right. So we got ourselves up with our thoroughly seasoned meat. Our, our left beef. Left beef. <laughs> uh, and then now, I think, are, are we almost ready to, to set up? We're almost ready to send them to the oven. Now, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good. So, you know, we got the oven going. Yeah, we're, we're just about ready to go. <laughs> you know, we've got the, the pie with a medium amount of cheese. The pie with, with just a normal amount of cheese, like a little bit less normal. Um, and then you have the, the pie with a lot of cheese, if we're honest. This is, this is a little overboard. And it has brownie pieces, which I'm still not fully sure of. So as this is getting ready to go, we will simply be patient. <laughs> Morpheus got into that. <laughs> Just yeah. left to me. No, I fucking missed his bunch of I know. Your milk. Yeah. <coughs> and the suffering of others is the same time Mr. Morbius. The attempted desperate gamble while first seems to be radical success, a dark inside him unleashed. Uh, will <laughs> good overrise evil, or will Morbius succumb to his <laughs> mysterious new urges? <laughs> The plus cinnamon. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nice. Boys! So it looks like it's time to cook the pizza. Yeah, so we got our three pies. Right, so you heat up the um, the bake and you're just gonna take it, drop it in. No. Put too much sauce on it. And just get those puppies ready to go. You know, toss them in there. So once that's all ready to go, you hide the pizzas. And while we wait, here's a message from our sponsor, Nick Scoria. Never trust the damn Italians. No, no, no. Nick's Italian. Un oh, right, you're Italian. 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 <laughs> loser. Ooh, loser. My biggest fear is that we take it out and we eat it and it's good. And it's good, yeah. right? That's <laughs> what so I'm scared of. Looks like it's right about time to test on that pizza. Check on our pizza. Check on our pizzas. Our pies. Maybe? We might have actually made something good. Just kind of like pick it out of there all desperately. Our, our one with the brownie. Nice and appetizing. Solid even. We'll put it right up to camera. Really get a sniff of that. Yeah, get a whiff. Yeah. Smell the vision. Get a just a little, little. You can see the reflection and all that grease. Now that's the good stuff. Now with this guy, we're gonna add in some of that meat we made earlier. The the left beef. Left so to speak. Left beef. Explode on the floor. You're not even holding it. <laughs> you... All right, everyone. Just take a take a look and the glisten. That's gotta be enough. Plenty. Just take a nice little gander. A nice little look-see. Cheers. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Fuck, why is it a million degrees? <laughs> is it good? Delicious. <laughs> You'll love it. Is none pizza. <laughs> it's like not. Try some of this today. It's a really quick meal. Yep. Um, nice comfort food. You just get the the <laughs> non. <laughs> Only took us three, two, two three. and a half hours. Three. <laughs> three. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in for the, the third episode. What did I call it earlier? Chef's Corner. No. <laughs> I called it like a. A, a, a three three call trilogy. The tri it is a three call. But yeah, thanks for everyone for tuning in. We will see you next year for more holiday delicacy. We should fucking close that. Yeah, I'll turn it off or something. I could do that. I think it's fine. Okay. This is better than the sandwich. Absolutely. The sandwich is fucking awful. No, come here.
There you go. You <laughs> couldn't see it coming. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> <laughs>